Hey everybody, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer, and welcome to another video on Oblivion. Today, we're doing this quest called Repairing the Orrery, and it says I've discovered a note from Bothiel at the Arcane University. If I can recover the Dwarven artifacts that have gone missing, there may be a reward. I should travel to Camp Ellis and see if I can track down these bandits. So this quest, I believe, is a DLC quest. Um, if I don't know, all the DLC stuff that I did, I started with at the start of the game, and this character, I've never played the main game at all. I, it's like, I'm Shia Gorat, that's all I did with Shiver Now. So, I've never done this quest before. It'll be interesting. I, I found a thing called a Dwarven Tube at a different camp, but, well, I don't know if there'll be anything at this camp. You know what? That dude was a lot scarier than he actually was. Didn't drop anything for me, honestly. Let's continue. So far, all the DLC quests I've enjoyed. Now, would I call them, like, DLC quests that I would pay money for? At this date, you know, maybe when the game first came out, if that was also a thing, maybe. But a lot of these quests seem to be things that, um, you can do, like, you know, maybe mod them in. You know, especially the whole, um, Frost Craig, you could definitely mod that in, but it's very cool. You know, Battlehorn Castle, I'm pretty sure there's even, there's a mod related to Battlehorn Castle. And then, of course, Dunborough Cove. I think you could mod it in. I, I don't know if... That's, I mean, people figure stuff out all the time. So what am I saying? We're at the camp. It said just recovered the artifacts. That's what I'm supposed... You've got a glass hammer. You are a big guy. Bandit Carrier. See, I found another one of these on a different file. It, it was named a Bandit Carrier, and he gave me a, a special dwarven... I, whoa, you're a tank, bro. I'm just... I'm not even gonna mess with you. Don't try. You're gonna get slapped. No. Go, go away. I don't, I don't want to deal with you. Oh, I got his hammer. Let's see. Curious of the Ranger. Why wasn't he chameleon, though? Hmm. Interesting. I mean, it's valuable. I'll take it. Dwarven cog and an undelivered letter. Well, let's drop this stupid glass war hammer and see what this undelivered letter means. Until a buyer can be found, the item should be hidden. Scatter them so the Legion pigs can't ferret them out easily. Else our safe spots the following camp. Oh, use our safe spots. Varys, Bodine, Brach, and Dagny's camp. Word will be sent when it's time to get rid of these things. Interesting. Well, Quest, what do you want me to do next? I found a list of locations at which the Dwarven artifacts for the Ori are being held. I should visit all of them. Yep. Well, looks like we're going- this is an interesting quest, so we're just gonna have to- Oh, that's kind of cool how they're all concentrated in one area. Because that logically makes sense, you know? They stole them. I did also find one at this camp, Last Chance Camp, so there- There was four camps marked. Oh, sorry, it was at Varus Camp. So, all the camps are- This is cool! I like this because- Oh, I'm an apprentice. I don't know what it said- I think I can- Yeah, I can swing when I'm jumping. This is cool though, because I feel like the only time that I've really um, dealt with camps is like, I think for a Diedrich quest, sometimes you have to go to a camp for some of the Diedrich quests. But other than that, they've really never done anything for me. I've never really seen any sort of use of them. You think the developers ever plan this stuff out? Like, I mean, I think, I don't know if Battlehorn Castle was actually there or that was just a road and quarrel that led to nowhere. But like, I mean, I bet they probably had ideas for quests and they're like, you know what? You know, th I mean, they feel special. Like this, this quest, where the hell am I going? This road leads to somewhere. I know it leads to somewhere. It leads to, uh, I think it leads to that place where that uh, Fingers of the Mountain guy lives. Okay, I'm kind of curious now. Oh, one, there's an alien ruin over there. Where does this go? Oh, it leads to a fort. Okay. Interesting. Hey guys, how you doing? I need uh, to take that dwarven cog off your hands if you wouldn't mind. I need it for, well, you guys stole it from the mage, and I kind of just want it back for her, if you know what I mean. Alright, looks like the important. You look important. You look like you have the best gear on. So we're gonna... Ha ha! Get your ass popped. Okay, you have a flame hammer. That's not fair. I mean, I have a sword that does stuff, but yeah, go away. I get paralyzed. Now, let's say you're that guy with the hammer. 
what is the most embarrassing way that you could die? From a guy using a butter knife. So go ahead. Go ahead and try, dude. Go ahead and try. Butter knife guy is gonna slash the crap out of you. But don't do your spin move on me. Chunky boy. Use a hammer, because you really have no way of defending yourself. You ain't smart. Oh, ow, that hurts. Spin move. Well, guess what? You healed twice. I'll heal twice with my weak healing potions, because I know that I can just deal with you. Ready? Dealt with. Dealt with. Dealt with. Where's your dwarven thing? Elven Curus, Helmet of Magicka. Sylvan Scout Boots, Fortify Speed. I don't know what my other boots do, but I would love for my speed to be fortified. And uh, what does your hammer do? Warhammer of Fire. Well, first things first, what boots do I have on now? Shock. I think speed's more fun than shock. And I believe I have on myself. I don't have a feather potion. He roared at me. Oh, you're gonna miss. No, oh, I don't even care, dude. I don't even care. I'm leveling up my blunt whether you like it or not. Because, you know what? This thing has no one chance on it. And I'm still gonna kill you because you're an archer. And you let me get close to you. Easy dub right here. I mean, easy. Look at this. Oh, stumbled. Guess what? Easy dub. And something else is up. What the hell? God, that's another one? I'm gonna have to use a special, uh healing spell on myself or something. Summon a golden saint to help out. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. And then I think I'm just gonna use this, uh, I think actually rem remedies the move here, because I, I need my fatigue restored. Yeah, mm. I mean, get, get distracted by the golden saint for like 12 seconds. There we go. Thanks, golden saint. You're, you're a real trooper. You, you, I, I like you. Okay, let's see this abysmal level up. There's an elven dagger right there. Let's see. Abysmal? Uh, agility 5. Hello, hello. Ooh. I'm not gonna level up my strength. We're gonna do speed and endurance. Maximum efficiency. Now, before I go to these camps, I am going to sell off all of my uh, stuff. Because, well, it's weighing me down. God, this the Gold Coast, like this whole section to the left of Skingrad is just... God, it's so beautiful. Like, it, it, I think this part of the map especially doesn't get explored a lot. Like, this part and down here because, well, there's this chunk of land here, but this chunk, it's because it's like in between this Kva like Kvatch's right there, and you don't, like, no one just goes and explores, you don't go to Kvatch and explore around Kvatch, oh. you know, you explore maybe outside of the cities. That's a herd of deer. Am I fast enough to hunt the deer? Because if so, venison baby, oh yeah. Dude, hell yeah. Where are you guys at? I need to hunt you to get venison to make more feather potions. God, this is awesome. Yes. And also kill this guy and get his stuff. Oh, you're the carrier. No, don't try it. Don't try it. I mean, you made you made the deer run away, man. Like, come on. Like, I'm a soul trap. Do you have a soul trap? Which, I mean, that would be awesome. If I could take that off you. Let's see. Dwarven, whatever that thing is, take the soul trap. Drink one of these fine delicacies of potions. Oh, there's more of you guys. Oh. This is not the best I can do. No. Don't do it. Haha, -ha, you've been paralyzed. Guess what? I'm, I'm gonna use this hammer. Where's the hammer at? Uh, soul trap? Do I even have a soul trap? Soul trap? I don't. Where's this war hammer of fire? Come here. Where you at? Just, just power moves. Ha uh, yeah! Like hammer him. I know I move like a pregnant cow. It's because I'm smacking a paralyzed person with a hammer. Jesus. Ooh, a glass knife. I want that, because it's better than my elven one. Motherfucker. Ha! You have one too? Interesting, I leveled up and all of a sudden, everyone's got glass knives, which is great for me. I mean, I'll take, I'll, I'll get money. Well, we got the, the thing. We just gotta raid one more camp. I hope this isn't the only part of the quest, because this quest is a little kind of easy, if you think about it, because you really just, if you think about who you're killing, you're just killing like, bandit ringleader type guys with a couple of extra like archers or melee fighters so it's not that hard ebony bow that's what i'm talking about that's what i need right now it's just an, a bow that does stuff man I i'm getting kind of annoyed at using this hammer to be honest so we're just gonna easy mode it right here like look at that no you're a red guard you're supposed to be able to resist this but no get cut Ooh. Ooh, Helmet of Enlightenment, Spellbrick, oh my god. I have recovered all of the missing artifacts. I should take them to the Bothiel. 
Got him. <laughs> you know what I think I'm gonna call it here? I'm gonna say that we're just gonna stash our amber. I mean, except for the shield. Actually, no, the shield reflects spell is it's pretty nice. We'll shelve it too. We're gonna shelve our amber armor. Because we're getting to that territory where we're just... I mean, the gauntlets, I don't have a different pair of gauntlets, I don't think. But we're getting to that point where it's just not as good. Well I forget met. to put that sheet go right stuff on every single time. So we're gonna sell them this. Uh, we're keeping the air. We're gonna keep the ebony bow because I think it does more than ruins edge. Yeah. Eh, just by a little bit though. Eh, I'll sell it. I want the, I want the cash. I'm getting greedy here. Elven arrows, sure. Why not? Uh, arrows of shocking, yeah, for sure. We'll sell them one glass dagger because we're gonna stash this other one. Iron arrows, we don't need them. <laughs> and the warhammer of fire, hell yeah. And then uh, all of the. the Elven stuff. We have, you oh got my it. god, we have a lot. But wait, we're not done. We have all the mithril okay. armor. Dude, oh my god, we got 10,000 coins, man. Any any problem they throw at us, at least for a, a good solid couple of minutes. Tree Runner, we don't need that. For a good couple of tries, we'll be able to throw money at it and be fine. So we're gonna do a couple of things in here that we gotta do. So. I have all my stuff, dude. We're gonna put the amber armor over here. As cool as it is, I think it, it's it is uh, it is that time that we we stash it because it's really not helping me too much anymore. Because the shield was helping me, but we'll just use this elven one instead. Um, and then we're gonna drop the raiden the raiment here too because it's it's I carry it around in case all my armor breaks, but. My armor's just so good anyways. The Ring of Happiness, I really don't need anymore, so we're just gonna put it down right there. And uh, what else do we need? The Talisman, I don't really need the Talisman anymore. So ho hopefully this ring here doesn't get ruined. I'm, I'm terrified of it, as I should be, you know. Uh, this one will keep Shigoras regular on the other thing. And this base ring of retribution, we're just gonna sell. And then uh, the durable elven dagger, it's just a weird item. And then dust fang. There it is, right next to the fork. Um, I don't know. I don't know about it. Um, it hasn't been very useful to me, even when I do nourish it, which kind of sucks. But you know, and the superb steel cutlass, cause it's cool. Okay, let's uh, let's head to the the lady who needs to know the things. And we'll see about this dwarven stuff we got. All right, what would you like, Bothiel? I have all the dwarven parts. I mean, that's something, right? Uh, hopefully it, you Susan? like it. I love Battle Mage. God, the Arcane University. So cool, yet so useless now, because we have Frost Craig Spire. You have Bothiel, them? I do. The items I requested? Mm -hmm. Give them to me, please. Okay. Yes, yes, this seems to be everything. Here's your reward. Thank you again. You're welcome. What did you Go ahead, What did you give me? I should give her a day to make the necessary repairs, then visit it again at the Arcane University. Oh, I don't know what she gave me. It looked like it was just gold, because I remember having like 10,000. But we'll just wait and see what happens. Let's see, the Ori should be functional. I can visit it as often as I like, and also receive powers based on the phases of the moon. What? Let's see. The Ori. Is that another door? Or was it just there before? What? Whoa. Um. Okay. What's going on? What's up? Uh. The console. I have activated the Imperial Ori. God damn it, Torch. Well, I see it tells us the phases of the planets and moons. I receive a new power. I already have a power. Interesting. Masser's Might. Fortify strength, but drain speed. Interesting. 
So if it's a different phase of the moon, I get a different power. That's so cool. Well, I think I do like a fortification of strength because even though I'm slower, my character's already fast and I can hold more stuff. So guys, that's gonna do it for this episode. Wow, I didn't know that was in the game. That was cool. I'm glad that uh, we found that. So yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do next. I'll check my quest log, check all sorts of stuff that I got and uh, yeah, we'll see what's up. We'll see what's going on from there. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. Hope you all enjoyed this episode of Oblivion. And, well, see you in the next one.